Hello, and welcome to the first short installment of Down the Rabbit Hole. I'm your host, Knight, and today we will be talking about Jack the Ripper. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Jack the Ripper was probably one of the most infamous and prolific serial killers, terrorizing the streets of London, England's East End, primarily the Whitechapel District, in 1888. He is known to have taken the lives of at least five women, known as the Canonical Five, but other murders in the area at the time were thought to have been him as well, though those are not confirmed. Those five victims were Mary Ann Nichols, Annie Chapman, Elizabeth Stride, Catherine Eddowes, and Mary Jane Kelly. All five women were found to have their throats cut. However, Elizabeth Stride and Catherine Eddowes were killed only an hour apart, Stride having only a slashed throat, leading investigators to believe he may have been interrupted, since most of the other victims were also disemboweled. After Eddowes was found, a taunting letter was sent to the chairman of the Whitechapel Vigilance Community, George Lusk. Along with the letter came part of a human kidney. In the letter, it was claimed to belong to Catherine Eddowes. Other taunting letters were also sent to the police, which some were published in the local newspaper. After the death of Mary Jane Kelly, the murder seemingly stopped, and she is believed to be his final victim. Jack the Ripper was never caught. No one knew who he was, therefore nobody was ever charged with the crimes. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If so, drop a like and a follow. Leave a comment, share with your friends, 